there's a lot of photographers who have a, a style, and that's what they do. Um, I maybe a bit butterfly about these things, flip from one thing to another in some ways, like to experiment, like to try new things. And therefore, I, I cover most things, I think. Um, I still love my, my traditional black and white. So on the iPad here, I'll show you where we go. Um, going back to traditional, real um, black and white, strong black and white, and this was actually taking Bally home, uh, not far from where I live one night out for a walk, lovely big cloud and really strong and I'll show you the app that helped make that up as well. Uh, using the wide angle lens on the camera uh, on the phone there that um, down Titanic and the, the, literally I had the, the, the phone on the ground and it gives great perspective going through, very strong and it got grain and everything into it, you know, so it works well. This wee one um, is again Bally Home. Um, beautiful sunlight, walked out the house one night, saw this beautiful thing, sea was way out, and if anybody can see in the background, or we'll show it later on, there's a, um, a panorama. And so what I did was I took this and then I went uh, back, and uh, as I turned around, I saw the panorama, and I did that as well. So if I don't see it here at the moment, we'll show it to you later. Um, they, these are sort of like the portraits, you know, that you can take. This was done before I had the telephoto lens, so you know these were just simple portraits taken in the house, uh, and the kids loved them. This one here was taken um, down in uh, Connemara, Galway direction, um, where down, a group of us were down there for a few days, and this girl uh, was doing some posing, and this girl also as well, uh, one of the models. So we got a, a nice set of, of pictures of them. Uh, Seamus Heaney um, took some photographs of him one night um, and this was uh, one I, I ended up finishing up processing. And um, this one here, this was shot in Hips the Manning. Um, and this character, Tony, he's a, he is a character, dress is just like that. And I met him in Belfast one day, pure by chance, out taking photographs, been planning to do his photograph for ages. And I ended up, I said, oh yes, okay, I'll, um, let's do your photograph one of these days. And he says, well, and I says, no. Nah. So we just stood over in the, uh, out of the way a wee bit, and I took, took quite a number of shots, but because he's so tall, uh, I took two like that there, and they pretty well joined together. Uh, it actually elongates some slightly more, but I liked it, and so did he, actually. I think it worked very well. Um, down at the um, harbour in Harland the Wolf, um, one of the uh, oil rigs was being um, uh, repaired and just happened to have been rain and a lot of the empty ground uh, was covered in water so it got nice reflections. There's a lot of uh, uh, bits of growth of plants coming up here and apart from the colours added and then a bit of texture to that one and I'll sh again I'll show you the texture. This again, Titanic, is, um, and that was on to the uh, really super wide um, lens so that you've, you're really distorting, but it actually looks quite, quite attractive in that way. Uh, panoramas, this is, well this here's the, where I was saying the same night we did the one of the yachts, and when I turned around I saw this view, you can still see my shadow in this one here. And again, this is something I'd like to show, is that the panorama, you'll notice that it's not straight along the top and bottom, it's um, curved and there's bits at the end and everything else. And that's because I'm taking these as individual photographs. So I'm going sort of click, 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 click. And then the ground, click, click, click. And then using um, auto stitch to bring all these together. I like that sort of border. I, yes, I've done clean ones as well, but I actually quite like it. Um, you know, it gives a, um, just a nice feel to the whole picture.